Hi guys, this is Mary from the Mary and Joe channel and, and this is Joe. Today, we're sitting around at home, so I decided that I had two projects to do. One, put together a shelf that I bought, and two, I need to do a cooking video. So, that's what we're going to do today. I don't know who that is. Joe okay. Clyde watching people feed the fish at the park at the gazebo. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Y'all know who that is. Okay. Joe Clyde watching people feed the fish at the park at the gazebo. Okay, guys. This is my bathroom shift that I'm putting together today. And I need to tell you that I didn't start videoing this at the front because I thought I had my video set to on and it wasn't. So I've got all this spread out and uh, let me tell you where I'm at and how I got there. This is where I started. This is a Room Essentials bathroom shelf that I found at Target in Houston the last trip I was on. So I had to unbox it and spread it all out and get started. And I vowed to put all this together myself. It's got looks like a hundred pieces. And it's got the directions. Says uh, Room Essentials like Five Chef Bookcase. Mm, and it's on the assembly no, instructions. I've started at the front. And it gives you some stuff to read before you begin. Uh, Tells you the tools you need. And then uh, it gives you a site that you can go on on your uh, computer or iPad, and that's what I've done. And I've followed the steps uh, so far, found all of my screws, and put them in these little separate containers. I'm down to the last two, and I thought I wouldn't have nothing left, but I got two pieces left. And I'm working on the legs right now. And on my video, uh, I went to this site, how to assemble, and it just gives you, I mean, step by steps, how to put this together. So I'm following these instructions, I mean, step by step. I've already been working for two hours. So, you can follow me through the uh, end of the steps. And I must tell you that while I'm putting this shelf together, Joe is looking at Law and Order in the background, and we don't own any of that. It's just the TV. So you can see it says put it together on the carpet, and I've got it just all over the place. But it's going to be beautiful. So... I'll get back to you. The, we got the legs together and we start putting the back of the shelf on. I've got both sides of the legs already fixed and the back of the shelves are laying on the floor underneath. Okay, we're at step five and now we're going to insert five metal pins into the holes shown in the right rear leg. And I've already done that. There's my one, two, three, four, five. So we've done that step, and then it says fasten the back's G to the right rear leg and tighten the five hidden cams. So that's what we're going to try to do. I'm sitting here uh, on the floor, and now we're putting the... the 
boards on the back. Remember now, I'm looking at this video and it's showing me uh, what I'm supposed to do uh, with these little screws I've already got here. You, you gotta match them up. Just put them on like this and twist these little screws we already got in here. Quite easy, just lock them. And this is the last one on this side. And there's a little screw right here on the back that we've inserted that you turn and lock. Just turn it until it locks. There you go with a Phillips head screwdriver. Wow. Okay, as you can see, we just fastened the backs to the right rear legs and then tighten the hidden cams. We've done that. That's mine. And this is the picture. So this is where we are. Now, the next thing we're going to do is step six. We're going to fasten shells B, C, D, E, and F to the legs of H and J and then tighten the 10 hidden cams. So, we'll get to that. This is F right here and we're gonna fasten it to the legs. I think I'm gonna have to change my direction. Hang on. Okay, this is F. And we hook this on like this. Take our screwdriver. And I have to go to the other side to let you see some of these. But right now, I'm going to try to get this one stable. It's not that bad, but take you around here. You see, we had to tighten these two brackets right here, and that stands them up. Okay, now I'll continue to do this for the next four shelves. I'm finished with step six now. We got to put on the other side, the other legs. It's looking good, y'all. I'm getting it. Well, we're getting there, and I'm bound to put this shelf together, all hundred pieces of it. But it's hard. I'm uh, down here on the floor, and trying to make sure that I'm looking at the video. And it's giving me some good advice on how to put this together. And uh, it's five shelves, so that's what I'm doing now. I'm reading my steps, and I'm uh, looking at the video to make sure that I got this going the right direction. Because I believe if I get it off, I'm going to be real messed up. So, with your patience... And my will, well, we'll get this done today. I'm on my third hour, y'all, but I'm working. And it looks like it's working out pretty good so far. Just all I know is to keep going, and um, I'll get this chef together today. Well, this is the last chef. So we got the shelves in, y'all. But now it's time to put on the other side of the legs. But we got to match up all these holes, and I'll get back to you. Okay, both sides are done. 
This is step eight, put the top on, and I've just finished doing that. Well, guys, look at this. Me and Joe have stood this shelf up, and this is the finished product. It looks just like this picture on the box. Well, this is me, y'all, Mary, looking frazzled, but I've worked four hours on this shelf, and it's finished, so I hope you like it. Oh, I need you to like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.